Twins and White Sox. Kevin Euclid with the new look, making his White Sox debut against Francisco Liriano in first inning. There it is, that trademarked batting stance. Euclid with a weak ground out to shortstop to start his White Sox career. Now 1-0 Twins, bottom two. Brian Dozier at the plate with a man on. And Dozier drops one into short right field. Plouffe's going to dig for third. Rios' throw is offline and past Euclid into the tarp area. Plouffe is going to score, and Dozier stands at third. So an error on Rios relates to the run against Jake Peavy. Then later in the inning, Jamie Carroll at the plate. Here's Carroll. Base hit center field. A huge two-out hit for Jamie Carroll. Dozier comes in. It's three to nothing. The Twins doing the job early against Jake Peavy. To the top of the fourth, Francisco Liriano doing the job. Puts down Adam Dunn, A.J. Pierzynski. Then in the sixth inning, Dunn frozen. In the seventh, Gordon Beckham hits it to a fielder's choice. Liriano goes seven innings, allows one run on four hits, strikes out five on the night. Glenn Perkins now in for the Twins, facing Euclid. And here it is, Euclid's first hit as a member of the Chicago White Sox. Euclid finished the night one for four at the plate in his White Sox debut. To the ninth inning we go. Matt Capps placed on the disabled list earlier in the day, so Jared Burton on to close things out, and Burton gets Alexei Ramirez to fly out for the final out, and the Twins win it 4-1. to one. Burton with his second save. Joe Maurer had three of the Twins' 14 hits. Ben Revere had four hits in this game for the Twins. And Francisco Liriano earns his second win. He has a 2.41 ERA in six starts since returning to the rotation.